Hi, Mike here at Sky Include. We are just passing Black Friday. Honestly, I'm deep in my Amazon or e-commerce or Web2 business lately, and I just want to make a quick video. This one's been on my list. I have a whole bunch of videos I'm making here on Sky Include. This one is understanding the keys of the root zone at ICANN and key ceremonies by ICANN. So let's dive in. So as always, it'll be on skyinclude.com slash ICANN-key-ceremony. I think they'll like this. I don't think they'll take this domain offline because of this video. But if ever this domain is taken offline, set up .skyinclude slash ICANN-key-ceremony to get it. All right, we always keep it on both DNS and HNS. All right, so with that out of the way, Kim Davies made a really nice tweet, and I put it on my radar back in uh, November 4th, 2022. So it's been on my list for a while. He is an internet tinkerer, chief parameter wrangler at the IANA and ICANN. So he made a nice tweet thread about the 47th key signing ceremony for DNS root zone in Virginia uh, and what happened. All right. So it's, it's really well written. You, of course, as always, I link this in the notes at uh, the, at the blog. You can of course read it yourself. He also has, in addition to this uh, blog, he has a nice, or that tweet thread, he has a nice video. I mean, and uh, he has a nice uh, blog post at his uh, personal blog, Kim Davies right here, which will also be linked. And I've been reading through that and I quoted some parts here. So the core part, and there's also a three hour uh, YouTube video you can watch of the live streaming of them doing this in Virginia. Um, so those are the authority places to read it. You know, I'm kind of the, the hobbyist trying to figure this out as more of an internet user than a uh, privileged key holder. So I'll try my best to discuss what happens here. And uh, I have, of course, notes. But essentially, this is every three months. Every three months, this happens. And the one that just happened in November 2022, November 3rd, I believe, is for the, the first quarter of 2023, January, February, March. The next one seems like will be in February 2023 in the West Coast. So there's two different locations they do this. One is on East Coast, Washington, D.C. or Virginia. The other is in the West Coast in the L.A. area in um, uh, another part of it. I can't remember the city it's mentioned in here. So it's either in the you know, D.C., Virginia area or in the L.A. greater area. There's two different locations where these hardware and their exact replicas are the same or similar setups. And what happens is there's seven key holders that represent the uh, trusted parties of the Internet that sign these root zone and DNS sec for that three month next period quarter. So um, where is it? Right. So LAX in Los Angeles and D.C. and Virginia, um, they work the same way. What are they? You know, experts um, examine the steps of the process, ensure it's done correctly. So it's, you know, it's here. It's recorded and streamed on online. You can watch it here. It seems like they have multiple cameras going at the same time. And they're showing you so that you can trust the process and trust um, the key holders that they are um, taking care of your internet root zone. Mm. There's also some upgrades of equipment that was done also on the streaming. And uh, there, it seems like you can even apply if you want to go. Um, you know, I wish there was one in Asia or in Europe, but they're both in America, uh, East Coast and West Coast. You know, um, not sure why it can't be also in other global places. Um, but that's that's I think you know the main the main point. It's like a three hour ceremony streamed online, and it happens every three months to do the next quarter. And it's either an East Coast or West Coast of America where all this uh, root zone signing and ensuring that the Internet and, uh, you know, I guess the uh, TLDs and the different uh, seven keys to the Internet. Um, 
is it more complicated? Of course, there's more to it, right? But, um, yeah. There's more to read. But, um, but this is a key ceremony. So how does this relate to Handshake? And why am I talking about this on Sky Include? I believe this is what blockchain in general is supposed to improve. It's supposed to improve this process of uh, humans needing to be trusted to go into a room and stream or record. And honestly, I'm not, I'm, I don't even know how I would verify this, to be honest. I, I could watch. I didn't watch this. I've seen it before. Uh, not watched the full thing before, but I've seen this videos before. And uh, it seems that there's people actually reading it or uh, watching. But basically, um, this is what I believe blockchains are supposed to s s uh, improve. And I think this is what Handshake was specifically meant to improve. And the thing that attracted me to Handshake personally over other Web3 naming protocols is this complementing and soft fork. It's not trying to replace ICANN and the current internet. There's uh, I Alexa 100,000, which a pioneer doing. And in mainnet, you know, has all these reserved names, which we've tried helping promote and get others to use and then it is supposed to you know integrate and not have collisions and, and uh, not have overlap and replace the need for ICANN to need to do this in person because it's a proof of work, proof of work blockchain and it is a uh, global 24-7 always online system that you can trust the verifications and the minds of the blocks you know, I know there's some critics here that says, you know, right now that it's a small chain. It's, it has some uh, some flaws because it's so small, but I believe it will grow. And I believe this is a more superior way than having seven people with some witnesses in a basement in uh, Virginia or in Los Angeles, greater area, uh, streaming a video on YouTube. I think this is a better way. And we welcome ICANN. ICANN has a lot of uh, coin of HNS allocated and, and held for them. So uh, I just think that's a better system. And I think that's what Handshake's trying to do. And you can also watch skyinclude.com slash soft fork where JRGA shares about this vision and uh, and reasoning. And of course, uh, thank you for this, uh, Kim Davies. And uh, appreciate it. I hope you don't mind me uh, uh, sharing this.